didn't have the dun 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 I set it so that like I could see if I could enable progressive scan on and this game's not compatible so but I want to hear that dun 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 you like the GameCube logo uh, yeah. animation a lot of people love that so much I'm one of it's, them it's very nostalgic I can't press that because I'm not player one I, I mean I'd argue that hold on is there a place for me to put this yeah. hey. I'd argue that all the Three consoles have some sort of. Also, can you give me my gloves? Yeah, you can. everything. Oh my god, you remember that? Yeah. Oh my god. But yeah, I argue that every single, like the Xbox, PlayStation 2, and GameCube have their own iconic, <clears throat> like, menu screen, you know? Mm -hmm. Like how, like, Xbox has, like, that nuclear green thing, and PlayStation has that. Dun! Kind of, like, yeah. blissful, like, type of noise. Mm -hmm. And even then, back then, like, PlayStation 1 had an amazing, like, Thing. Same thing goes with Dreamcast as well. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so uh, this is the first time we're gonna do a game. Do a game, that sounded wrong. <laughs> you're Anyways, gonna, you're yeah, gonna you, do a game? That, that sounded very wrong. <laughs> Wait, would you like to introduce um, the game for us? Well, actually, first off, I'm basically doing great. I'm Mellow. And uh, this is Harry Potter uh, Quidditch Cup, is that correct? Quidditch World. Quidditch World Cup? Yeah, Quidditch World Cup. Alright, awesome. We should probably lower that small. One issue whenever I was like editing the uh, Kingdom Hearts game was that the echoing behind the thing, you know? Oh. But yeah, uh, you have more experience with this game than I have, so who cares to explain? Uh, not that. I stopped playing. I'm uh, not like, uh, I don't know the game you I just know how to play. Would you like to explain like, the rule set before we start off? I mean, and you probably, you probably back, know the whole thing when it comes to Harry Potter and Quidditch. I haven't watched any, like, of the Harry Potter games, uh, Harry Potter movies, aside from the first two. <laughs> uh-huh. So, uh, ready to load. Alright. No safety. So, where are you loading exactly? Can I? Wait. Can I create a safe data? I'm confused. I'm a little bit worried. There's no options menu. What's going on? Go to inventory. You think it's in inventory? Options. Okay. Don't know why that's the case. Oh, hey! There's a white screen option. I need to select. Oh. Did it help? Uh. Huh. Maybe? I don't know. I can't tell. The way some games are programmed, it's not, like, clear. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if, like,. It saved the game or something because there's like no load game data found or whatever. Oh, um, maybe because um. You think it's saved per like Hogwarts battle or to learn the basics of Quidditch whatever it is. Compete for the Quidditch I don't know. <laughs> you you played this game as a kid a lot, didn't you? No. You didn't? No. Nope. You owned the game. But I didn't play that much uh, as a really? kid. Really? Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, I guess it's gonna be news for us as well. Let's I just mean... go to Hogwarts to see what's up. Welcome to Hogwarts. Now that you're here, you can choose which of the four house teams you'd like to take through to the- Oh shit, start. we get to pick one of the four Who's houses. Door? Let's go Great Slytherin. Door. No! Slytherin. No! Well, what other option? Hufflepuff! Hufflepuff? What's wrong with you? I'm a proud Hufflepuff people! You Hufflepuff peoples are so innocent and weak. Hey, we As are- a Slytherin, we are more of the- I'm very- <laughs> Right. Uh, who's this fucker? That's, um... No. Wood. Quidditch is Wood? easy enough to understand. Yeah. There are seven players on each side. Three of them are called chasers. This. You want to uh, load it upwards? Yeah, because you need to learn. This ball's called right. Quaffle. This is a good way to learn that thing. Yeah, yeah I shut just up. Wish it was like I tried to get it through one of the hoops to score a goal. Ten points every time the Quaffle goes through one of the hoops. No. There's another player on each side who's called the Keeper. I'm Keeper for Gryffindor. I have to fly around our hoops and stop the other team from scoring. I don't understand that Stand at all. Back. The bludgers walk around trying to knock players off their brooms. That's why you have two beaters on each team. It's their job to protect their side from the bludgers and try to knock him towards the other team. The box is floating in the air. <laughs> I just realized that. It's so sad. You have not stand the darn game. I can kind of get to some so far. 
Three chasers try and score with the Quaffle. The Keeper guards the goalposts. The Beaters keep the Bludgers away from their team. Now the last member of the team is the Seeker, who doesn't have to worry about the Quaffle or the Bludgers. This is the Golden Snitch, and it's the most important ball of the lot. It's very hard to catch because it's so fast and difficult to see. It's the Seeker's job to weave in and out of the Chasers, Beaters, Bludgers and Quaffle to catch the Snitch before the other team's Seeker. Because whichever Seeker catches the Snitch wins his team an extra 150 points, so they nearly always win. A game of Quidditch only ends when the Snitch is caught. Any questions? No? Wait, he caught it! <laughs> hey, you win! <laughs> oh, and one other thing before you choose your house team. If the team you select does manage to win the Hogwarts Quidditch Cup, you'll be awarded a ticket to this year's Quidditch World Cup. If you win the ticket, you'll be able to choose an international team to support right through the tournament, hopefully to the World Cup final. Okay, so if you'd like to choose your house team, we can start to play Quidditch. Alright. Soul Slytherin, right? No. Yes. Yes. Hold on. Alright. Yeah! Because <laughs> what other options are there? Uh, Slytherin is the wait. only... Wait, best option, right? I want to there's I want to say right, there's well, co-op. Uh I think we're not co-op. I want to know, but, uh, know if like there's a way to like change this later on. Mm. Well, since this is my game cube. Press well done. <laughs> You've made the only smart choice. See? Slytherin. See? He oh, told me I made the only smart a, choice. You are such a little <laughs> prick. Well, I mean I'm a little prick, huh? Compete. Come on. Let's meet the rest of the finest team at Hogwarts. <laughs> I like this guy already. He's so direct. <laughs> okay, but seriously though, um, yeah, how do we like play cooperatively? Press back. All right. Exhibition? No. You think? Yeah. Okay. Okay, there we go. Yeah, here we go. Try moving. You can only move the D-pad, I think. Oh. That's so weird. Alright. So, we're fighting against each other now. Uh-huh. Alright. You guys got the controls? Tricky cards required. I'm guessing... Okay, so we are only able to do the Comet 260 right now. That's for the... the broom. Alright. Okay. Uh, Hogwarts Summer, Winter... I guess those are the only two options. You would like... I guess Christmas time is almost coming up, so... It's not even past Halloween yet! Well, it's almost about to be Christmas, okay? But yeah, I'm thinking it's like, okay, so, hold on, the Seeker who gets the, what's it called? Welcome. The Snitch. The Snitch. That's 150 points, right? Yes. Each goal is 10 points, it doesn't matter which hole it is. No, you gotta get into opponents. Yeah, opponents' holes, like... Yeah, it doesn't matter which hole. For they them. all just cost 10 points. Yeah. Okay, so theoretically, if you get the goal 16 times, and the game ends when you catch a snitch, right? Yes. Okay, so let's say someone catches a snitch, that's 150 points. But the other team go, go, uh, scores like, what you call it? Uh, 16 times, right? Does that mean uh, the other team wins regardless of who catches the snitch? Mm -hmm. Alright. Okay. Alright. Oh, you little. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah! Oh my what? Oh no, you idiot! Juicy, whoever you are. That was his name. <laughs> Go in. Uh. Damn it. Okay. Oh my god, please. Oh my god, how did I fucking there? Damn we it! Haha! <laughs> I got ten points. Alright. How do I shoot it? Uh, press B, I think. Back up, boy. There yeah. we go. Yeah! <laughs> that was necessary animation time. That's a slow ball. Alright. Crap! Haha! <laughs> oh my god! Stop! <laughs> no, you stop. That's my ball. It's my rifle ball. Give my ball back. Mm. Haha, <laughs> thank you. Juicy! Gets the loose ball! Has anyone seen the snitch? Possibly do it! 
snitch. Actually, how do you, like, with this kind of game mechanics, how do you exactly do you get a snitch? You see the line? Oh, what line? Look at the... The what? The screen of the score. The screen of the score? Hold on. Yeah. Okay, so like the seekers literally just seek out where. Oh, so those two, right? Yeah. Okay, so there's two snitches? No, it's completing the snitch. Oh, okay, so there's two halves of the snitch and we just yeah. need to. Okay, I get it. Ugh, this is a very elaborate game of football, you know? <laughs> or at least a very simple game, I think. Yes. Look, I'm getting my ass kicked. Yes. <laughs> Nope. Damn it! God damn it! What's her name? Give the ball to the dude! There we go. Yeah. Now stop getting stolen or whatever. Fuck off! Get it. One. No, no, no! So by the way, we didn't really get any practice in. In case <laughs> yeah. anyone was wondering. So, well, she probably had some practice in. You own the game, right? <laughs> Aha! Damn it! Oh, what? here goes the. Was it? Now we're back at the snitch. Okay, who's getting the snitch? And how do you get the snitch? Right? Oh, fuck off! Fuck off, mate! Game faster. Come on. Damn it. Yeah, Hufflepuff. You Hufflepuff are so into it yourselves, aren't you? I'll get you next time. Oh look, we we uh, shook hands. Yes. All right, at least that guy's nice. So it's just that one dude that's kind of an asshole. Yeah. Holy fuck, you were creaming me. All right, match statistics. What does that exactly say? Saves, shots, one goal. In th Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, what are the controls again? So like, A's pass. Is B shoot or Y shoot? Mm hmm. Oh shit, oops. You still want to be a uh, Hufflepuff? Yes. Alright. Do you see the controls during the loading screen? Or? Yeah. Okay. B is shoot, A is action, and Bruce. Okay, so it's very simple. Yes. Alright. And it looks like you didn't get that down. I was a little bit like confused, that's all, because I like, did it just use two buttons or what? I like And also during the um when we get the uh snitch. the snitch, like do we probably pull the A button to go faster or yeah. Okay, yeah, I was confused at that part. What is it? Okay. You already saw this part, right? Away we go! No. Throw it. With a long pass. What did you get the loose ball? I'm trying to shoot it, but it's not working. Because you're not trying to shoot it through your own goal. With a nice save. You have to get all the way to my side. So I can't just shoot from far away like a three point line? No. There's no like. It's not like basketball rules where we can just like roll the, no. the thing all the way to the other side. Come on. Nope. Ugh. So unfair. You have more practice in this game. I'm not doing anything. Uh, oh crap, you can't skip this. I'm not doing anything. All I'm doing is just playing the game. Only three or like five people. I can't tell. Takes the 
Oh, so where's the clobber like guy comes into play? The beater? Yeah, the beater. They only go against the bloodthirst. They don't go any other character. Alright, so... Why are they part of the game? So then they could take a, a deal with the bludgers. That's their what their what that's what it is. Okay. Like they have no part in the game as well, or crap? they do. They just keep make sure that you don't get hit. Okay. So they're kind of like referees in a way, or what? No. Oh shit. Why is my name Juicy? <laughs> Oh my god, stop it! <laughs> stop it! Oh my god! I'm trying to pass the damn thing! Yeah. Now throw it! There we go. Don't go backwards, you idiot! Oh my god, I. Ugh. The AI is so fucking bad. It's like, I can only control one character at a time. It's like, how are you doing that so good? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I'm just. Playing it as I go. She shows great strength in the target. Grace, flick, grab the quaffle. He's got the pass. No Montague. Okay. With the tackle. Passes. Heidi McAvoy. Passes right. Adrian Pusey. Graham Montague. Flips it. Tams in Appleby. Heidi McAvoy. Yeah, it's time for getting the cool the stitch. Uh, <laughs> but okay, so wait a minute. Out of curiosity. Did you see last? Was matter slowing down? Doesn't oh my god, look at look! Woo! Oh you caught it, but you feel like you lost on the inside. Kind of, yeah. Cause you were doing all the goals and the only reason why I was I apparently caught the thing. Caught the snitch. So yeah. there's, l there's literally no point in like <laughs> fucking doing the goal thing at all. It's literally whoever gets the snitch at the end wins. Yeah, because it's 150 points. That's that's a dumb rule. <laughs> That's such a dumb rule. And the fact that it ends the game as well, if you, whoever yeah, catches it. You didn't get any from the. I from didn't the get point. any, but I still won! <laughs> <laughs> it's so bullshit! <laughs> it's so bullshit. <laughs> Quidditch is a stupid game. Look how many shots I had. Exactly! You got so many goals, and yet the only reason why I won is because I got the damn thing. Yeah. It's like, what the hell? Yeah. It should be more like a time based thing, maybe? Mm -hmm. Or like maybe like nerf the fucking Quidditch, or nerf the goddamn like a uh, thing. What's it called? The snitch, right? Yeah. They should nerf the snitch so that's a lot more of a balance. I'm thinking, I'm thinking over like a fighting game standard here. Like how, uh, like I'm thinking like how to balance catch this game right now. Like it's like I'm gonna be, I'm a game designer or something. Like it's a fun game, I think. If like the controls were a little bit more like there instead of like just two buttons and a control stick. Mm -hmm. And I think if like the rule set was a lot more balanced, it could be a very, very fun game. Are you planning on playing the solo so we could start getting some? Uh... Maybe if we unlock a lot of things more. Than... Well, but no, you have to get. Um, uh, to get what? Cards. And how do you? We do that by like playing the game, right? Yes. Okay. All right, we can do that like after this game. So this will be like our tiebreaker. Mm -hmm. And whoever wins will represent the com campaign board, I guess. Yes. Will it be Hufflepuff or Slytherin? Thank you. I can't play name, by the way. Who names their child Juicy? Throw the damn ball, Juicy! Not there! God! Oh my god, Juicy! <laughs> Juicy, you're fired after this game. Seriously. Thank you. Oh my god, I hate Juicy. I should kill him. I hope he dies in the next movie. Damn it. Come on. Take it. There we go. 
Oh, nice. Thank you. Juicy, you fucker! <laughs> okay, maybe I shouldn't be Slytherin just so that I don't have fucking Juicy on my team. Because he seems to be like... Like, look at Hufflebee is so good. Damn it. Who's that a blonde kid again? Huh? The blonde kid, that's like the main villain, I think. Uh, Draco Malfoy? Yeah, he's a good guy. <laughs> he's strong, I like him. But fucking Juicy is like... Draco, what again? Draco, what's it? Draco Malfoy! Jack, Draco Malfoy should teach him a goddamn lesson on discipline. Come on! Please! Oh no. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> this is a stale game so far. Nice. Come on. Steal it back! Steal it back! Get it! No. Okay, team, from now on, never trust Juicy with the damn ball. He will not keep it. Fucking hell, Juicy. Come on! <laughs> Is this how like your mom acts whenever she sees like the Warrior games? No. <laughs> like, God damn it, you can do it! Oh my God! Stop, Stop fucking up, LeBron James. Um, he's not in the Warriors. Uh, I, don't know. I don't watch basketball. How am I supposed to know? LeBron James is is, is is in Lakers. Lakers. Yeah. Isn't that like the team that we used to support before San Francisco actually like yeah. built their own basketball team? Yeah. Actually, they're at Oakland. Oh, it's Oakland. They're close yeah. enough, right? No one got it. No. So literally, it's all up to the Quidditch now. Yes. I mean, the, the snitches thing. Oh no. Fuck. Yeah, Hufflepuff! Uh, I, guess, I guess you'll be uh, representing Hufflepuff for the world tour. I hope you're happy. Yes! Uh, God damn it. Actually, you want to use your controller instead? Yeah. Okay, okay. we just have to disconnect, that's all. Mm -hmm. Ugh. So, how do you feel? I feel defeated. <laughs> Damn it, Hufflepuff. I blame I blame Juicy. Fuck Juicy. He does not deserve to be a Slytherin. He is so imperfection that it's it hurts. Uh, you know how to get to the uh Yeah. Alright. Damn it. Damn Hufflepuffs. Damn juicy. See, yeah, pick me, pick me. That's what he's saying. Thank you for choosing the Hufflepuff Quidditch team. We God want damn it, you pansy ass yes, motherfucker. <laughs> so we'll start with some training. Is this how all so Hufflepuff back? Just to meet you. Let's go. Because I feel like when it comes to like Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, and uh, the fourth guy, they are based purely off of like personality traits. I think. Like Gryffindor is like the loyal, like strong hero type characters. Whereas, like, Hufflepuffs are, like, the kind-hearted, but also kind of weak people. Mm -hmm. You get it? Mm -hmm. And Slytherin is just, like, the assholes. <laughs> and, fuck, what is the fourth one? You remember? Huh? What's the fourth one? Um, Raven Ravenclaw. Okay, Ravenclaw. I don't Hello, know what they Jeff. are. Malcolm Priest. Pleased to meet you. I'm one of Hufflepuff's chasers. This house challenge is all about passing the quaffle. Alright, so you're learning how to pass, I think. Mm -hmm. mm. This, this game also has Game Boy Advance support as well, right? Yeah. Do you happen to have one of those link cables lying around? No. And Me neither. Each chaser, you'll see a magical ring. These rings will cycle between yellow and green. The chasers must pass the quaffle back and forth through the rings while they are green. Missing a ring or passing the quaffle through a yellow ring will cause that ring to turn red and the time penalty will be increased. Feels like you already know how to play the tutorial here. Hello. 
You think that that practice has been helping us? Press the action button. Use the broomstick control. Oh, try doing it in both wings at the same time. You think that's possible? I don't know. It'd be pretty awesome if that's the case. A Quidditch card. Get to like maximize your points there. All right, so there's that card that we just got, or what? We got yeah. one Quidditch card. Mm -hmm. How many more do we need in order to unlock everything? Should we make a save? Yeah, we always need to make a save. <laughs> okay. This is, I guess, this is the only way we can save the game, right? Yeah. Mm. Kind of makes sense. Like the multiplayer is there just to have be the multiplayer. Oh, that's why. Because we didn't have a save file. Because I was using my game data. Our first Quidditch oh. Card. Mm. The more cards we win, the more the Hufflepuff team will be able to do. These cards will access Wait, the Hufflepuff specifically? As well. you can take a look so do you think we eventually have to play as all the teams and make so them do the best as well? Just right, unlock everything? Press this button and the I, I just hope this game doesn't get too repetitive later on, that's all. One out of 104, wow. Chaser. Yep. It's just a card, that's all? Mm -hmm. All right. We could trade. Oh. <laughs> we can't trade apparently. It has something to do with the Game Boy Advance game, you think? Yeah. Mm. God, if only we were able to cover Game Boy Advance, Link Cable shenanigans, and anything. Hello, my name's Heidi McAvoy. I'm a chaser for Hufflepuff. This challenge concerns tackling and shooting at the goals. Alright. So, so you think that the fact that we practice helped a lot this with the one tutorial one so far? Between mm -hmm. one of your chasers and a ghost. Edgar Cuggs is the ghost in question, and he's been hanging around the Quidditch bench for as long as anyone can remember. Edgar was obviously an extremely proficient Quidditch player in his day, and he's going to be flying around the pitch with the quaffle, trying to avoid your chaser. The aim of the challenge is to tackle Edgar. Take the quaffle from him and throw it into one of the goal hoops. Edgar will, of course, not only try to prevent your chaser from getting the quaffle, but will also try to prevent them from So you, you, um, when you hold the B button, does it, like, Hello. throw harder or something? Again. Don't forget, press the action button well, to tackle. Hmm. And the does it, like, throw harder when you hold the B button, or is it just... Oh, or is it just like an animation thing where like you hold on to it for a while? Mm. Oh, holding the A button? No, holding the B button. Oh no. It doesn't do anything, it's just there so that you could like recognize that you're throwing? Yeah. Okay. So it has like no power to it whatsoever. You just automatically like, aim it and I it knew works. We could do mm -hmm. it. Mm. Oh, you did it! 45 seconds! Holy shit, you used to be a speedrunner for this game! Oh my god. <laughs> what? I, I don't think anyone has ever speedrun this game. I'm, I'm pretty sure there are some, it's just not common. Save like, it over, or...? Yeah, save it over. We're gonna use, like, each, like, save file for, like, probably one of each, like, house party or something. Okay. <laughs> I think, I don't know. Unless we get to ch change it mid-campaign or something. Mm. What are the reviews for this game, by the way? I don't know. Yep. Do you want? Do you want to know? We didn't even introduce his name. <laughs> or oh, you're going back? I'm just more like, when are we gonna battle? I think we just keep playing like one of the teams and like just keep going in from there. That's my guess, at least. Because like there's, you saw like the locked option with the World Cup, right? Yeah. So I'm guessing like I missed. God damn it. <laughs> I'm guessing that um, once we beat all the tutorials, that's Hello, when we actually nice set to course to actually find someone. You mean battle? Captain yeah, battle. You know, this was a PC game too, right? It was PC. Yeah, it was on every console, wasn't it? Ready to like, when I was browsing around eBay, I saw like PlayStation 2 and Xbox version of this game as well. I only went to the GameCube version because, I don't know, I like GameCube. Mm-hmm. And at the time, I didn't... Um... Actually, no, never mind. 
Uh, at the time, like I wasn't really comfortable Golden with the Snedget Xbox controller. Golden Snedget has from a Snedget reservation, mm -hmm. and because I'm a seeker, I don't know, I'm just very heavily biased towards GameCube games compared to Xbox for some reason. Now, even though now I do want one. Actually, no, no, yeah. The reason why I didn't why I want to get the Xbox version was because like I only have one Duke controller and one regular controller. And I don't want to resort like one of us having the Duke controller, right? Mm -hmm. So like it's probably best to just get the GameCube version instead. Mm -hmm. PS2 could have also been a better option as well, but like PS2 footage tends to be very bad. So I wouldn't want to get the version since I think that's like at least the very least the second best version you can get. Uh -huh. So yeah. So that bar on the left, that's like your super bar. Like yeah. they're going faster. And the more you're in the middle section, the more it charges up, right? Yep. Okay. Three! Oh shit, you got three! What can we get now? First match unlocked! Oh, okay. Yeah, I get to pl uh... play your first match. Mm -hmm. Alright, who are you fighting against? It better not be us again. We don't want to be more humiliated because of fucking. Go! Go! Hufflepuff! Go! Go! Hufflepuff! <laughs> what? I'm a very proud Hufflepuff. I'm I know. Proud of it. I know. I already forgot the name of the guy I hated. <laughs> From Slytherin. You've done really well to have successfully completed your first three house challenges. Alright. Oh, you're fighting you're ready to the first real Quidditch match. Only the team with the most points wins the Quidditch Cup. Remember, from here on, you can replay any Hogwarts house team to better your score. Oh, I guess it doesn't really matter then. That's your first match, I think, against Ravenclaw. Yep. Alright, good luck. Ready for a match against Ravenclaw, are you? Oh, is that a girl? We'll see just yes. how ready you oh really shit! Are. Those are rare in this game, because <laughs> like the first three like house parties that like I've seen so far, they're all dudes with dicks. Mm. <laughs> I mean, there are some girls who are chasers. Yeah, but I haven't seen any like at all. Like I've seen like guys with female voices, but I never actually seen like females in the game. Mm. That sounded like a legit female there. I'm assuming. <laughs> Alright, well, good luck against Ravenclaw, whoever they are, because I don't know them. How prominent are they in, like, the movies? Ravenclaw? They're yeah. intelligent. They're intelligent? I thought that was a Slytherin. <laughs> no, they're more cunning. Okay. Because, like, whenever I hear, like, Harry Potter, I always, like, hear, like, those three, like, teams specifically. At least according to our group of our friends, but I never hear anything about Ravenclaw. I guess that goes to show that none of our friends are cunning or clever. Mm -hmm. uh, I already scored a point. Nice. You just have to make sure you do that 15 more times before you get the Quidditch thing. I keep forgetting with the, the, the snitch. Yeah. Yeah. Damn. Oh no! I like how uh, Gryffindor is the last one to go up against. Like because they're the best team. No, that has to be Slytherin, right? <laughs> <laughs> what is it? So, what does that make Gryffindor like go after if we're the Gryffindor team? Oh, we got a Quidditch ca uh, card. Another one? We're doing what? Um, Are they like the equivalent of achievements nowadays, or what? I don't know. That's actually really interesting. That makes well, I, I hate to give EA credit. <laughs> That kind of makes it so that EA is a little bit ahead of the time when it comes to like developing games for better or for worse. Oh my god, I'm like a blittering Ravenclaw. <laughs> That's good. You just yeah, you score like 11 more times, then you're basically guaranteed a win, right? We got another Quidditch card. Nice. Ha! Are there uh, any Ravenclaw fans out there in the comment section below? Because your team kind of sucks right now. Sorry to any Ravenclaw fans out there. What's like a very prominent like Ravenclaw character in the Harry Potter universe? Um, Cho Chang. She had the hots for Harry Potter. Is that like a Chinese girl? Yeah. That sounds very Chinese. And then there's Ginny. Well, Ginny is from Ravenclaw. Okay. Damn. Well, of course the Asian one will be on the cunning and smart, the smart team instead. Well, there's some black guys that are in the... Uh, okay, good, so they're balancing the stereotypes then. <laughs> I'm just saying, it's like, Asians are tend to be, like, stereotypical Asian, aren't they? Mm. Right? 
right. I'm not doing anything, all I'm Six doing- Six more and then you basically get an automatic win no matter what. Is it possible to like fail the footage of the captain? The the snitch catching? Um for both teams, like maybe. Both of them fail and then instead they like resort back to the goal posting. Oh. Yeah, so far like there hasn't been like a time limit at all when it comes to like catching the snitch. It's like whoever catches it wins, pretty much. Oh, oh. wow, that guy's nice. Oof. Yeah, level by 100. Lead by 100. It literally doesn't matter though because the because the snitch literally is the deciding factor of who wins. Okay, show off. Okay, then. All right, good luck because uh, all the work that you did doesn't matter. It's all up to this. Literally this. So far, I don't see your opponent yet, so that's good. I will say, though, I like the fact that this kind of plays in a 60 frames per second manner. I think. Hold on. I'll wait until you, you finish your game. Oh my god, I'm Four having a little game. bit of issues. The steering. Uh, how so? I don't know. We're gonna stay in the middle path, that way you get I am. Destroyed. I am trying to. Alright. Got it. Got nice. it. Yeah, does it say 60 over there? Where? 480p, what does that say, 60 or 30? I don't know, I can't tell, my eyes hurt. 40, 80, 60p. 60p? Okay, good. So, yeah, it is recording 60 frames per second, man. Because it does look pretty smooth, so at the very least it runs properly. I obliterated the Raven Claw. How much points did you get? 260! Five quarters card while new challenges oh unlocked. Oh my god, you... You just cream them I know, completely. <laughs> now you just gotta do the same for the other two. <laughs> do you unlock the other campaigns or do you still have to do like tutorial shit or challenges? I think I do more challenges to unlock Slytherin to unlock and Gryffindor. Okay. And then afterwards there's like more teams out there, right? Yep. Those we haven't we're I'm interested in unlocking at the actually. Moment, Hufflepuff is at the top of the league. Because it'll be pretty boring just to see the same four teams over and over again, right? Yeah. Yeah, so... But I'm proud. I'm guessing, like, the Quidditch, like... Teams are, like, from other Beaters schools. Beaters and Blunders. Special moves. Those two are the only ones... Oh, Combos no, there's more. Okay. okay, so I'm gonna do the Beaters and Blunders. Alright, and then after... I'm yeah, it's probably best to do it in order. Anthony Rickett and I are the team's beaters. This house challenge will help you to defend against bludgers. Oh, I don't think I have to deal with bludgers during the entire Quidditch Cup, the Quidditch game. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Like if they expand upon more, left. Yeah, because like it uses a different button entirely. Mm -hmm. In this challenge, you'll be learning how to defend against bludgers. One of your chasers, flanked by two beaters, will be searching for targets located throughout the ground. What the beaters have to do is hit a bludger at each of the targets. Sounds simple enough. Except that once the bludger has hit a target, it'll rebound and pursue the chaser relentlessly until the beaters can bat it away. Cedric here with a reminder. Use the broomstick control to destroy the area. Press and hold the bludger button. Oh boy, the bludger. The bludger to launch the target. Are you controlling a specific one, or...? Like, you're controlling her right now, right? Yeah. Okay. And you're supposed to plunge in with this target? Yep, I, I, I'm basically... Doing that for all the targets. Yes. Alright, I see, like, three more left. Ugh. I'm basically controlling the bludger too. <laughs> Okay, Alright, one more left behind you, I think. Where's the last one? To your right. To my right? Yeah, back there. Way back there next to like the ocean or oh. the river. Yeah, I wanna know how this exactly affects the game. Quidditch 
God, I knew we could do it. Yeah, this I got a penalty. A 15 minute penalty or 15 second penalty? Yeah, that's fine. Hey, it's Applebee, the one that with the... Yeah, Applebee's fucking, like, amazing at yeah, her job. That's her, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. She's amazing at her job, unlike... What's his face? Juicy. Juicy. <laughs> fucking juicy. God damn juicy. Ugh. I, I will never forget him. Mm-hmm. What's his name again? <laughs> juicy. This is a one-on-one -on -one challenge between one of your chasers and our ghostly friend, Edgar Gloss. Edgar's going to try and take the bottle from your chaser and prevent them from scoring a goal. Edgar's in a particularly troublesome mood, and your chaser needs to employ the to avoid okay. him. Edgar's particularly expert at the special move techniques. This means it's going to be very difficult for your chaser to keep the bottle long enough to So you think it. that uh, with future maps or like stages, we have to like avoid all those as well during our cooperative uh, network? Our, uh, Versus play? Use the dodge button to avoid him and the shoot button once you arrange the goals. God dang ghosts. Did you dodge it? Yeah. You dodge it with X, right? Yeah. Shoot. There we go. is like annoying as fuck, isn't he? Come on! And you're by yourself? It says special move, so I'm assuming it's like, wait, can you do that hurricane thing as well? Mm. I want to know how that, like, can you actually do that in the versus what? Special move, press. Is in the inventory view, all the moves I've unlocked. Oh, okay, so like, once we like play more of the campaign, we get to like equip more like move sets and all that. I'm guessing this also affects multiplayer as well, mm -hmm. you think? L plus R or Well, I'll probably show it during the game. Yeah. At the same time I kinda of feel like this is a little bit like too grind heavy to unlock everything to properly play the game. But if you're like this is the only way, then it's like eh, I'm going against you. That's not me, that's Draco bitch. Well man. your team. Yeah, I, I guess. Okay, so now you are able to learn the bludgeoning tool and the dodge. That's so much of a hassle. So yeah, I think Hello, going immediately to multiplayer is not a good idea. Mm. We just want to try like a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit to see what's like, but then it's like it didn't really feel for me. But I think we unlock more abilities and move sets the more we play the campaign. Mm. That's my guess, at least. Once we do that, then we get to like have all the sandbox fun we can have with the Quidditch game. Mm -hmm. I swear, that teacher looks like she's always stoned off her ass. Have you seen those pupils? Like, so wide-eyed. Alright. Give Juicy help. Oh, 
She's so strong and metallical. What? Wait, what? Oh, oh, I'm thinking different. Sorry. For some reason, I was confusing you with them. Mm -hmm. I was like, wait, did you pass on the other side and then they, they pass it to you? But yeah, I was, I was just playing. That guy's already careful. I said careful. I was going to try to go to the <laughs> other goal. But you threw it to the right goal. Bludger, careful. Just trying to distract him. Yeah. Now. There we go. Yeah, look for a good opening so that you can like throw it at them. Mm -hmm. Come on! Come on! So Seeker's job is to catch the... Catch the, uh... What's it called? Whatever what it's called again? The Bludgers. No, 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 the Seekers. Their job is to catch the uh, small, like... Snitch. Yeah, the Snitch, right? Can anyone else catch the Snitch? Like, can the bludgers or the, the other guys catch the snitch as well? What the fuck? I did it. Did you just kill him? No. I just used a special move. What was that red aura like around the dude? Like, it looked like he disintegrated or something. Uh, interesting. Oh Damn it. my goodness. But yeah, what if, what if like someone that's not a seeker catches the snitch? You can't. They can't. What do you mean they can't? Because they're they're not allowed to. Or what? Damn it! There we go. So they're not allowed to catch the snitch. Otherwise, like that doesn't count for the win or anything. Team special move. Woo! What? <laughs> this is new. Are they fucking playing basketball with a spot? Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, what? Is that 20 points or something? Yep. What the fuck? Is that allowed? Is that allowed? The hell? Look what just did. It went up to 70. What the fuck? What's the rule set for this game? I am so confused. <laughs> How does this girl not fall off from that thing? Come so on. look at Slytherin's like other bar thing. What's it called? The snitch? Path of the snitch? Come on. It didn't like progress at all. I'm like, what's the deal with that? Because they didn't score any points. <laughs> Why is your phone still on? I think my sister's texting me. Is she just telling me if I have voted on the ballot yet? Which I have. Have you? No. Oh. There's like a lot of uh, like things that I need to research on before I like pick like mm -hmm. my favorite. <laughs> Damn. Siku what? What's the name? That's, oh. Yeah, that was a little bit too risky, I feel. I wanted to believe. <laughs> oh my god. The bludger got me. Yeah, you okay. should have gone for the right one. It's 
you gonna do it again? Yeah. All right. So you need three more goals to guarantee a win now. Do you think you could do that under like how long? You know, that's a little bit uh, like if he kicks it to the goal again, does that make it another ten points? He should have done that. So they made it like thirty points in total. So is it like because it's not out? That's why they scored the 20 points? Because like he, sh he, shoot he shot it, she kicked it back so that's not on the outfield, and they threw it back again into the goal again. Yeah. Is that why? Mm -hmm. Alright. Makes sense, I guess. Special move! Quick! Wait. I saw special move. Thing. Yeah, but it's not any of them. Alright, well, you just need one more point in order to guarantee a win now. Otherwise, even if they do catch the Quidditch, it's impossible for you to lose. Now, nice. Alright, you can just lay back and do nothing now, right? I mean, you could also, like, not have them post a goal as well. So maybe it's not best to not do it. Okay, now you can do nothing. Because <laughs> even if they catch the Quidditch, they lose, right? Yeah. Alright, so why are you trying? <laughs> are they even trying? That's what I want to know. You just want to completely decimate them, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I don't want them to get any. Any point, so it's just a complete sweep. Yeah. Wow, you are... You know, for a Hufflepuff, you're, you're pretty mean. Oh my god! <laughs> Come on! Got it! Oh my god, you're it. so mean. <laughs> you know that? But the more points... Uh, the more we could go to the uh, uh, Quidditch World Cup. Is it? Mm -hmm. Okay, that, that, that makes sense, I guess. Yeah, good games, bro, even though you completely creamed me. <laughs> 310! Oh my god. You are a monster. Thank you. <laughs> hey, yeah. So just one more until we get to Gryffindor, right? We are at the top of the league. <laughs> you think? <laughs> uh, wow. Poor Slytherin. What did they ever do to you? Now the last one is combos. Hello, I'm Herbert Fleet, and I'm Hufflepuff's keeper. This challenge is all about passing the quaffle and scoring. I seem like okay. I already know the knack of how to score. Yeah? <laughs> Combos, what are those? Well, looks like we're able to find out. Alright. This challenge is all about using combination moves. Combos. Controlling your chases, you need to direct one or more combo passes into the scoring area. You then need to pull up a volley shot to score a goal. I'll be there trying to stop you. If you fail to perform a volley shot, or I save your attempt, there'll be a time penalty. But, if you're successful three times, you might just get that school record for Hufflepuff. Cedric here, use the action button together with one or four of the combo buttons. Oh, so L and R um, all say two different goals? Use the broomstick control oh, to direct. Or different number of players? Use the shoot button Is it? together with the combo button to launch a special me. shot. I'm trying to listen. Alright, so was that L? And was that R? Okay, yeah, I'm guessing, yeah, it does have to do with, like, where you shoot, I'm guessing, right? <laughs> right? I did really badly. Right? Because can't tell. Oh. I can only hear, like, oh my god. Third match unlocked. Hey, are you ready to cream the Gryffindors as well? Yes. Are you ready to cream Harry Potter? <laughs> yeah. Beat his ass and take his lunch money? No. Send him back to his step-parents? Step Actually, it's aunt and uncle. Or aunt and uncle? Are they, like, blood-related, or...? Yeah, okay. on the mom's side. Okay. Well, his mom must have had, like, a horrible sister or something when she grew up. Oh. 
combo buttons. You can be used with B, X, and A buttons. Using these combinations give you a big advantage during Quidditch matches. Exclusively. All right. Ready for a match against Gryffindor, eh? Let's play for the Quidditch Cup. All right. So now all the buttons are unlocked for us, I'm guessing. Mm -hmm. So if we play the uh, multiplayer this time, all of them are unlocked for us. I want spring and fall. Never noticed like there's like some moments in which like the characters pop in into existence all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. You notice like that there's like that one frame where they disappear and then reappear. <laughs> yeah, it's a little weird. I think like when we play on the CRTV, it doesn't really affect much since they're CRTVs. Oh, nice. I'm scared to fight you now. Why? <laughs> it looks like you're getting better. Like, I should probably play the next match to see how I do. Okay. All right. Or training? Yeah, training as well. Oh, nice. No one. I, did, I didn't expect no you to catch that guy. No know. one didn't even bother trying to catch it. Yeah. Like I was a little bit worried when you threw that, but actually you made it, so that's nice. Oh my God, Gryffindor sucks. <laughs> You know, can I say something? What, what was her name again? Honeybee? Applebee. Applebee? Yeah. I think she's my new favorite waifu. Oh, no. <laughs> she is so good at this game. <laughs> and she also has like that nice attitude about that sportsmanship too as well, you know? Yes. I think she's my favorite. Ooh. Applebee is amazing. How old is she? How old is everyone in this game? Old. I mean, <laughs> old enough? No, you're too old. Uh, but if I was like a kid back then, then it'll be fine, right? Mm -hmm. Right? Yes. Uh, I set No, because the bludger was. Uh, oh, there was a bludger? Yeah, it was after me. Oh, okay, That's why yeah. I had to ran away for a few uh, seconds. Yes, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, I didn't see the bludger at all. I don't even bother with all the moves, so I could just. Uh, just Plus I, do all of that. Or right side, right side. It was like, there was literally one guy in Grifter that was guarding the right side, and for some reason he just book it. He just ran away. He's like, nope. He's like, nope, I'm gone. <laughs> Alright, so, special move is Z. Is it? Yeah, team special move. Okay. It, it is, is it skippable, or? No. You have to watch it. Okay, so... The ball being on the floor doesn't count as an L. As long as it's in inside the inner rings, I don't know. it shouldn't count, right? Mm -hmm. It's my guess, because like he clearly, or she clearly threw like threw the ball to the ground and it bounced off, but it didn't count as an L. Mm -hmm. So my guess is, as long as it's still within the playing field, then it shouldn't, then it's not gonna count as an out, and it's still viable for you to get that ball, regardless. Uh-huh. Yeah, what is that, like, old, do you remember, uh, Road to El Dorado or something? Road to El Dorado? Yeah, it was, like, that DreamWorks movie. Yeah. You know that game where, like, they play, like, the, it's kind of like a combination of basketball and volleyball, except, like, the hoops on the side? Yeah. Like, this kind of reminds me of that, in a way, you know? And it also kind of reminds me of that one scene where the ball like automatically went to the hole like a lot. Mm -hmm. Remember like with the what was it like the critter or something? Actually, like, that was a. Like, uh... I forgot. It was. It's been a while since I watched that movie. But there's like that one scene that reminded me so much of that, and I imagine how many points that cost it. And if it's and if you could do that in this game, and it'll still be legally viable. Mm -hmm. uh... oh, damn it! The bludger hit me. Yeah, I noticed the bludger too. What's the button to uh, escape from the bludger or hit the bludger again? You just gotta hit, uh... You think it's white? Yeah. Okay. Oh, they're 
cheering for you. You hear that in the background? Yeah. They say Hufflepuff, Hufflepuff. Wow. Clearly deciding the winning team here, huh? <sighs> Do we even need to do this anymore? I think you clearly won here. Team Special. I'll do it after. <laughs> We're gonna cream them so badly. I know. Can't get it before the snitch. Oh, you yeah. did it. <laughs> oh my god. You have to have the, the, um, the coffee first and then do the Team Special. Is it a different animation for every team, or is it going to be the same animation? Same animation. Same animation by what? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yay! That's a little boring. <laughs> I was kind of hoping like every single team has their own like unique animation to them. Oh, well, look at the 200 points. Like, yeah, you don't need to even do anything else to win. Like, there's literally no point in them playing anymore. <laughs> Okay. Oh. <laughs> well, good luck in not winning. <laughs> you know, the broomstick kind of looks like a, you know, those like painting brushes. Yeah. It's like a gigantic version of that. Like brooms, like bro like the end of the brooms are usually like tilted or like, like what's it called, like a triangle, right? Something that was more like an oval shape, man. I don't think that's a good, good room. That's the case. It's aesthetically pleasing, but like it's not gonna work well as an actual bird. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, Harry Potter looks like an asshole. <laughs> they actually made Harry Potter look like an asshole this. Yeah, it's the same animation for every character. Oh, it's the same animation for every. Oh. This year's Quidditch Cup to Hufflepuff, and to those of you who will be attending this year's Quidditch yeah! World Cup, have a wonderful time, and don't spend all your money on souvenirs. <laughs> oh, we're gonna spend all the money on souvenirs. Yeah, congratulations, you uh, you won against your teammates of the same school, and now we're off to fight against other people, whoever they are. So it's like, is it like, there's like a tournament from different, like, wizard schools or something? No, it's from around the it's World Cup. That means the world. League. Around the World Cup? Like no, Japan and France and all that? Yeah, they have that too. Okay, so what are their team names like? Well, only one way to find out afterwards. Alright. Because if it's something like Japan or France, I feel like that's going to be uncreative. <laughs> like, I want it to be like the... Oh my god, it is. <laughs> USA, Japan. Oh, come on. It's just Germany. country names? They don't have, like, their own mascot or anything? Oh, Nordic team. That seems badass. Bulgaria? Are they, like, the masters of this game? They are the best team. Bulgaria. So where's, you need 65 cards. Where is uh, Bulgaria located? Mm -hmm. oh, the Australia trip looks cute. So, so is the Japanese. England looks weird. <laughs> I guess we'll fight her first. So now we just have to deal with every single country that we need to deal with, right? So now it's unlocked. So sweet. And beating them is how you unlock their... Or, wait, what? Or do we unlock everyone already except for Bulgaria? Well, yeah, well, only for uh, Hogwarts is only for Hogwarts team and then everyone else is Dr world. Wait, what? Like, you can't fight a uh, Ravenclaw with an England team. <laughs> Why is that? Because they're, uh, they're, the, they're elite. They're elite, Pete. Hold on, let me see. Give me that. Yeah, you can't go... What? Th yeah. Oh, well, that's bullshit. Well, because it's school. This is the World Cup. You can't have... That's dumb. But we get to play everyone except for Bulgaria, right? Yeah. That's boring. Okay, now you can go. You give the. You can play with your with a different team, as in Slytherin. All right, 
Um, how do I do that? Go to Hogwarts. So it's my turn to play through the, uh... Is it gonna be the same tutorial, though? Well done. Yeah. You made the only smart choice. Slytherin. I'll show you the right way to play Quidditch. Of course, we're going to have to teach you how to compete. Come on, let's meet the rest of the finest team at Hogwarts. This is a very long dialogue animation, like, holy crap. Mm hmm Okay, so yeah, we could fight. Alright, let's go with Ravenclaw first, ready because for a match against why not? Ravenclaw, are you? <laughs> okay, we'll we'll see just how ready? ready you Jeez. really are. Let's play for the Quidditch Cup. Alright, so why is... hold on. Okay, here we go. Bludge, yeah. shoot, and dodge. Alright. And combo attacks. I'm guessing that's for aiming. Welcome, this is Lee Jordan. Alright. See if I could do it any better. Oh, My friends and skills. With a quick pass. Montague. Passes. Nice. He makes the save. Pitch is such a good keeper. Okay, there we go. Got it. All right. I think I'm getting a little bit of the hate of this. Hopefully, if I'm like competitively vile, we could <laughs> get my revenge on Hello. <laughs> Yeah! Uh, yeah, this is a lot of fun if you... Once you... Oh, oopsies. Once you know how to play properly. Dodge. Or is it just telling them for that team? Yeah, the other team doesn't seem to, like, know how to, like, pass the other player at all. Come on! Damn it. Uh, no. The Slytherin guy that's, like, next to our goal post. Come on, you can do it. Like, this part is, like, really fun, though. It's just that I don't think, um... When we get to the catching the snitch part, that's at all, like, fun. Because, <laughs> like, that's a side fact. Unless, like, you manage to get, like, a huge lead or something. Yeah. So I think, like, if they want to make this game a little more balanced, they really need to work the fucking, like, snitch. God damn it. Yeah, you're having issues. A little bit. Just need some practice, that's all. Uh-huh. Come on. Damn it. <laughs> I can't look a little bit too, like, far away, but... You got a push card. That's good, at least. No. Nope. No, I wanted the right side. Now, what the? No! You throw it! There we go. Changes the goalpost, right? Yeah. I'm not sure how exactly it accurate. Watch out for the bludger. Oh, right, uh, sorry, why, right? Mm -hmm. okay, well, they won't be using it for time. Oh, crap, wrong. Okay, there we go. You're wondering how. It's all how? about, like, God, like, trying to pay attention and then make a quick decision. Like, you have to, like, know what you're doing. I keep doing that. Yeah, and you saw how uh, how I did it. Yeah. You probably just question like, how did you get so many points? No. I'm being very careful. Like, as long as I'm like close enough, that's where I like shoot. And then you see me. Yeah. There we go. Quick pass, Montague. Passes. Pusey. He shoots. 
Oh my god, Juicy actually did something. His name is Koosey, not Juicy. Well, what, I'm still calling him Juicy. Why are you still calling him Juicy? His name is Koosey. Because that's the name I keep hearing every time I hear his name. Ooh. No, that's not. Yeah, I made a mistake there. He's clearly guarding after. Ow, you asshole! Did you just bludge me? No, he used the um, the special move button to. What's the special move? Oof. Can I use it? Yeah. It Press B, it. and then. There we go. Okay. Take that sucker. See, um, Slytherins are really brute, brute force. That's why he kicked you. And that's why he. Ow. And that's why. I don't know, Ravenclaw seems pretty ruthless as well. Uh, for us, we just grabbed it nicely and gently. <laughs> it was like, I'm just gonna take it. No. Just speeding up afterwards. Yeah, it's very risky to try and throw it from far away. But it is kind of doable. No, you need to you need to get better possession. Ah, they didn't. They didn't complain about me. Jeez. Wow. Oh. No, Michael. <laughs> Fuse bomb. <laughs> For girls like that, you know. Yeah, but Slytherins are awesome. Is there like any girl Slytherins at all? And all the Slytherins I know are like dudes. Oh, uh, plunging X, right? Or. Fuck, what button was it? Nice shot. Damn it, Juicy! <sighs> okay. You were so worried. I love it, yeah. Well, there we go. Are you actually going to do the snip for now? Uh, might as well. Just get yeah, like cracks in my right face against you. Mm -hmm. Are you that scared of me? A little bit, yeah, because you really know how to play this game. All I do is just pass around and just shoot. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I just just pass around and shoot. Why are you so scared of me? Because you know when to shoot and all that. Can I do that yet? No, that's for an opponent, not for you. That's I can't do yet. Oh, you dodged. Use the dodge one. Yeah, I did. That tends to be a good if in case like there's someone like behind your tail. Mm -hmm. Ooh, the snitch is so close to complete. I know. No. Oh, okay. Well, the He dropped it! He passed. I didn't drop it, I passed it to the opponent's side. What's wrong with you, commentator, man? Adrian Pusey! Alright, well, doesn't matter. Alright. Let's do this. I am not that scary with trying to catch the snitch, man. Bless you. Thank you. Okay, I think I can kind of get an idea of how to properly do this most ma max efficient see as possible. Kind of. Like, if there's like a straight line, then that's like the max speed you can get. But if there's like a curve, then you're gonna slow down a little bit. Come on! Grab it! Got it. B! Oh, B! I've got it. There's a button you can press as well. Oh, okay. 
Um, you have to uh, do challenges. I have to do challenges? Mm -hmm. How do I do that? You're saving over my? Wait, what? You're saving over my, uh, my thing. You better not. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, how do you do challenges then? You go to you go to Slytherin's thing and then you. Yeah, Slytherin's but as soon as I went to the Slytherin thing, it would send me here to the fight against other people. No, because you hadn't because that's you clicked on versus Ravenclaw. Oh okay. So, so you look nice. Go to. Yeah. Challenges? challenges. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I need to bother with all the other like enemies though. So I'll just do the house challenges. Marcus Flint, Slytherin Asshole. He is Marcus Flynn is an asshole. Ma Marcus what now? Marcus Flynn. He's the asshole? Oh. Mm. He's a asshole. Okay. <laughs> I'll see it when I believe it. This is all about passing the quaffle. Your three chests will be flying in a V-shaped formation. Between each chaser, you will see That's a magic the same thing. ring. So far. These rings will change color. Yeah, so it's a good way for me to practice with this. The mm -hmm. chasers must keep passing the quaffle through the rings when they're green. Missing a ring or passing the quaffle through a yellow ring will make it turn red and there'll be a time. Yeah, but don't do that because it has to be in the green or yellow. Right. In case you've forgotten, pass the quaffle with the action button. What? <laughs> so you're missing hella bad. Look at you. Uh, nope. Uh, why'd you move? I went to the right. What the hell? <laughs> Fuck. You've beaten the team record. Hey, that was I beating the team record. But you didn't get any Quidditch cards. But I beat the team record. Oh my god. <laughs> That's an achievement, right? Ugh. Right? Ugh. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> uh. I think it still saves behind your save data. Yeah. Regardless but... if we're in different. I shape. like my first place. Uh, all right, fine. You want you don't want to hinder your thing. Yes. All right. So maybe other challenges will help me a little bit more. She said, "Pick me better. You better pick me." Uh, this guy, right? Graham mm -hmm. Montague's the name. Chaser for Slytherin. You're about to learn about tackling hard and shooting at goal. Alright. Seems simple enough, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I've been doing this for a while. This is the ghost guy, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. This is a one on one challenge between one of your traces. Why'd you guess this? What? Yeah, what? Uh just to complete the collection, why not? Should you have missed it, press the action button to tackle and the shoot button when you're in range of the goal hoops. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Not sure why you went backwards or something. Why? Oh, God damn it. There we go. Get back here. He can't tackle me? Alright, that's good. Sacked him out. You've <laughs> beaten the team record. <laughs> Why do you have to say team like that? Because Draco Malfoy's an asshole. You've beaten the team record. <laughs> it's like he sounds so goofy when he does that. He doesn't. Like, he's if he's just, trying to be a bad he's guy. He's supposed to sound like an asshole, okay? He doesn't sound like an asshole, though. He sounds like a dumbass. Oh my god. Like, team! Instead of, like, just just say team. It's, it's, you don't have to be all, like, expressive with your teeth. He's supposed to be British. Are all British people like that? No. Uh, well, they're all British, definitely, aren't they? Mm. Like, all their voice acting and all that? Makes sense, like, the production studio... Behind Harry Potter is like British, right? Mm -hmm. Draco Malfoy, Slytherin Seeker. I'm an expert at catching the snitch, and I'll teach you how to be almost as good as I am. Almost as good, huh? Yeah, so that means like you're not even up my uh, uh, my alley.
Kelly. But at least he's nice enough to teach me, right? <laughs> hey, look, I'm trying to think of the positive aspect of Slytherin, right? You may be assholes, but at least they're proficient. The best secret Hogwarts I've been asked to catch. Best secret police! It's Harry! Are you sure? Harry got created by the Hufflepuffs. I'm saying as in, in the movies. Yeah, because it's also my father's going to hear this. My father's been the best. No, 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 he's. No, his father is. Who's his father? Who's his father? Um. I call him Mr. Malfoy. Mr. Malfoy? The school record! The school record? Kind of sounds a little bit Fargo, don't you think? No. Not really? Oh, it's Lucius. Lucius Malfoy. Lucius Malfoy. That's the dad's name. God, all these British names. There's no way I could, like, pronounce them properly, like, let alone, like, speak in a British accent. Mm-hmm. Like, I could probably do, like, almost every other accent except for, like, British. I could try to kind of do, like, a Cockney a little bit. Although but, you're like, finally going to discriminate them. Uh, maybe. <laughs> but yeah, British people is like I can't I can't talk like you guys at all. You guys have like your own unique voice that I can't mimic. <laughs> Big Lee! He sounds like a school jock. I don't know. <laughs> Looks like it. Yeah, he's even a beater too, so he's probably one of them. Peregrine, Derek and me are the slivering beaters. Beaters and bludgers? Ha. I know We like to beat all meat. That's what I think about him like Oh, okay. you, know, you know, like those football guys. That so like far, just... you're making fun of your own. I know house. they kind of like they kind of are like punchable. <laughs> I'll admit. Well, why did you choose them? I like their ideology, but I don't like their people. One of your chases. They're like Trump supporters. <laughs> so you're a wolf. I'm not one now. I'm just saying they're kind of in a way. Uh, okay, so why is to launch a blunder? Mm -hmm. You control the blunder. I, I can control the blunder too. Bludger. It's called Bludger. It's called Bludger. Not Blunder. Now avoid the Bludger. Okay. There we go. Now avoid it. Avoid it. I tried to punch it to avoid it. I'm not sure if that counts though. Okay. So how do I avoid it again? Just move around? Yes. Okay. Whatever, last one. So you you beaten the team that hard. Why that helped? What? It didn't sound remotely British that time. Whatever. Fuck. How the hell do you avoid that thing? You've beaten the team record. Only Look one. how many penalties you got. It's only one minute. I'll be fine. Minute penalty. One minute penalty. Whatever. <laughs> Am I gonna get I'm barely getting any, like, cards out of this. Because you're getting penalties! <laughs> so you gotta play this game, like, perfectly if you want to learn everything... Is that right? Mm -hmm. Damn. It's gonna be a while till we like unlock. Was it Bulgaria or something? Bulgaria. It's Bulgaria. Is that like a real country? Mm -hmm. <laughs> something I never heard of before. Georgie and Pusey, Slytherin chaser. This is where you learn about dodging and special Pusey. move tackles. I'm still gonna call you Juicy. <laughs> Pusey. I'm still calling you Juicy. You better not fuck up this time, Juicy. <laughs> Out of all the Slytherins, you're the weakest one out of the bunch. This is a one-on-one -on -one challenge between one of your chasers and that annoying ghost Edgar Clogs. It's not the only thing that's annoying, am I right? Stop them from huh? scoring a goal. All right. Edgar's being a real all right, for real, Juicy. And your chaser needs to use the dodge to shake him off. Edgar's an expert at the special move. Which means it's oh, going to be really hard for your dodge. chaser to keep the profit for longer than a couple of seconds. Get back here, you fucker. Malfoy here with the reminder. Press and hold the special move button to shield the target over the annoying ghost. Release the button to tackle it 
use the dodge button to evade and the shoot button once you're in range of the goal hoops. It's not difficult. Stop getting into the circle. You got to run away from the circle. I'm pressing the X button to dodge it. That wasn't a really good toss. But this is. Really? I'm not gonna make it. Yeah. Dude. That move's annoying. You have to run away from it. You can only run away from it? Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Get out there! I did it. What's that 60 mean? Because it didn't use special move. Fuck off! It didn't give me the option! I was just being too fast, that's all. No, yeah, you could use it whenever he had Anytime to. you want? Yeah! I didn't see the prompt. It was B! There was a B button! Oh, I thought it was a Z button or something. B! It was Z B? is a P in special move! Oh, fuck, I didn't know. <laughs> God damn it. Whatever, I did it. I, I did it. Because I kept thinking that B's gonna just shoot the thing. That's why I never used it. Because oh, I don't want to like drop the ball or anything. All right, well, at least I unlocked the chef, the thing for... What's it? Gryffindor? I mean, not Gryffindor. God damn it. Slytherin. Mm -hmm. Alright, lastly. Kevin Bletchley, keeper for Slytherin. I'll tell you all about passing and scoring. Alright. So this is where the combo comes into play. Mm. Alright. This challenge is all about using combination moves, combos, controlling your chases. You need to direct one or more combo passes into the scoring area. You'll then need to try and pull off a volley shot to score a goal. I'll be there to stop you if you don't get it right. All right. When you fail to perform a volley shot, or I save your attempt, there'll be a time penalty. But if you're successful three times, you might just get that score. Nice job. Is that him? Break our mouth for yes. here. Use the action there. Both of the combo you have to do first combo, combo one pass. and combo two. Use the broomstick controls directly. You're only using combo. Okay, range. now you use combo. Two. Yeah. Fuck! With the combo buttons to launch a special shot. Whatever, I did it. <laughs> You've beaten the team record. And I'd beaten the team record too, so I I'd say that so was so much victory. damn penalties. So I'd say that was a accomplished, well done. You suck. I did, shut up. <laughs> shut up. I did it, okay? You sucked. I, I blame Juicy. <laughs> oh. Is that your only excuse? I, yes. Because Juicy sucks. Where's the, where's the paper? There it is. Alright, we're going to play one more round of threes. With all the information on board. So, wait, what do you mean? Versus mode. Oh, yeah. This time with all the unlockables that we just got. Okay. Ugh. You want me to still be player one? It doesn't matter. Okay. Actually, yeah, yeah be a uh, player two this time. Match. Since my controller is like close to um the left side. Yeah. So that way we don't get like all tangled or anything. Okay. Okay. So. Where are you? Actually, what are so? Why are the other teams like? Do we play differently, or are they just for aesthetics? Aesthetics. Okay. For now, we'll just play with our own team, and then maybe, like, afterwards, we, uh... We'll play with, like, other teams. Is that good? Mm-hmm. All right. And, uh, did we unlock... Okay, we unlocked this. The Nimbus 2000! One of the Nimbus Racing Grooms Company's most successful models. Highly reliable with good speed and exceptional handling. Not for beginners. I'd say we're advanced players enough, right? I am. Shut up. <laughs> We'll do, we're doing this. Uh, summer, or we already did winter, so let's try summer. When are we gonna get the spring? I think we just have to play more of the game and unlock it, right? Mm. That's my guess. So yeah, everything I think Hello is unlocked, there. right? This is your very own lead, All right. And they're off! With the pass! McAvoy! Brace! Quick 
pass. Flint throws it. Juicy. Priest grabs it. So strong in the tackle. He takes it. Montague. Juicy takes the quapple. He's got such great desire. Flint. McAvoy steals the quapple. She's the one you want to watch if you want to learn how to really tackle. Appleby! She takes the quaffle! Passes! She steals it! <laughs> I'm just like... I'm like taking it back every time. Yeah, but so am I, so... Throws it! Flint makes a Same. great tackle! Aha! Nice job, wherever you are. With a quick pass! Flint! Damn it! Yeah. I was trying to use the bludger. I, I knew that you were going to use the bludger, so that's why I like book it as fast as possible. Come on. You missed. <laughs> Please stop taking the quaffle away from me. Oh my god, I need to get it away from my goal. But it's not... Oh my god! Oh my god, you plunge it! Juicy! McAvoy takes the quaffle! She's the one you 
want to watch him. You want to learn how to really jack him. Cut it off. With a quick pass, Montague Priest steals it. McAvoy passes it off. Priest passes. They need to get better possession. Priest. Woo! What's a snitch thing you had? Still hasn't completed yet. It's taking a while. I know. Flips it. He drops it. He grabs it. With a quick pass. Montague. With the pass. Juicy. McAvoy goes in. She's got such grit to Zoya. Throws it. Montague. Take the shot. Ha ha! You tried it. Really? <laughs> yes! I'm still in it. Just need to prolong until the Quidditch snitches thingy activates. Oh no, I dodged. Uh -huh. That's the dodge one, what the fuck? Oh. Oh, thanks! Oh, God damn it. Got you. Oh. <laughs> hey. No. Nope. There we go. Finally. Fuck damn time. Yeah, this hey. is like a different move. Oh, I think that's only for Slitterin because they're so. <laughs> Do I get 10, 20 points as well? Yeah! Oh my god, that's a big ma- Did he just slap the camera? Yeah. God, what an asshole. What's his name again? Malgo whatever, whatever. Not Drago, but like Malgo something, right? Marcus. Marcus? Oh, it's just Marcus. That seems like a basic name. Shoots! you dodge, right? Yeah, but you don't have the option for the X button. What do you mean I don't have the option? On the... You, you can only dodge a certain amount of times, or what? Yeah. That's, what? So I can't dodge when, like, you're attacking me or anything? I have to. Oh, I... Now you have the dodge button. Oh, that's bullshit. Adrian Pusey 
I didn't mean to give it to the opponent. Deserve it. No, I'm really. slithering, damn it! We deserve something! What about us? You guys already got the cup. You already got the cup already, okay? So you don't need any more victories on your head disposal. We never got a oh. Close to like catching behind you, and then you were just blocking my pathway. 
Yeah. God damn it. Hufflepuff. Oh, God damn it. Uh, no, no shake. Good games. That was fun. Was that fun for you? Yeah. That was legitimately fun. Like, and now that I know that, um, at the very least, the um, score helps with how you catch the Quidditch. The snitch? Yeah, the snitch. Because notice how like my bar was lower than yours. You said catch the Quidditch. Catch the snitch, whatever. But yeah, you notice how like my bar was like lower than yours. Uh huh. That means you get the advantage, but there's still a chance that I could have won as well. Yeah, because you were so you were so close. Yeah, I was so close. I think that like that was a very good like way to balance out how you catch the quiz because beforehand catch the snitch, catch the snitch, whatever. Because beforehand when we were like just playing start off without anything, it was very unfair because like anyone could win. Mm -hmm. But now that it's a lot more balanced so that like we get all the things, it's a lot more mm -hmm. balanced, I mm -hmm. feel. Mm -hmm. I still think catching this snitch is a little bit like OP. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, it's like, yeah, if you're like already in the ahead of time and like ahead of score, like you have like 160 and the other player has like zero, then well, no shit, you're gonna win. Even if like you, even if like you like pull bags, like it doesn't matter. So uh, yeah, this was fun. <laughs> This was fun. Those are all the stats. I shot 13 times, you shot 14 times, and all I that. I have 8 goals. I didn't blunge a single hit, apparently. <laughs> I did! I'm really- I'm, so, I'm really good with hitting you with the blood- with the blood yeah, I have no idea how to, like, dodge a bludge at all. I think, like, maybe if I save up my X button for something, then maybe. Mm -hmm. But aside from that, yeah. Yeah, that was fun. Whew. Hufflepuff's the OP team. <laughs> Hufflepuff can kiss my ass. <laughs> oh my god! Why would you say that to Hufflepuff? As a Slytherin, you scum should bow down to us. Look, we never had any screen time except when Cedric Diggory is a Hufflepuff and he's now dead. Spoiler, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> well, we got Snape. We have Snape, right? That's our yes. teacher. Yeah, we got Snape! Yeah. And he's a strict but stern teacher. Yeah. Yeah. And that hair, you, you can't deny, he has fabulous hair. <laughs> I think we're done here. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is basically 3 and 3. It's Mallow. We're signing out. Thanks for watching. Hufflepuff's the OP too. Slytherin is better. No. Slytherin is totally better. No, Hufflepuff. Slytherin. Hufflepuff. You guys in the comment section will tell us. And then there's gonna be that one guy that said, no, Gryffindor is better than both of your asses. <laughs> or something. I am a proud Hufflepuff. No doubt about it. Go, Hufflepuff! Boo, Hufflepuff. Woo! Shame on you, Hufflepuff's the best!